I've decided to give other companies a shot on their neck fans. What is going on, my fellow following peeps? Welcome back to the Brandon OD channel. So glad to have you guys here with me in the studio on what I'm considering a perfect day for videography. It's an all day rain here in Michigan. So let me ask you guys a question. How many of you have seen my Taurus neck fan videos? I believe there's three. Yeah, three in fact, of all the same company. Oh Do you know why that God. is? I've been approached with many emails on these companies that are making neck fans. There's a ton out there, okay? But I've just never felt that any of them would be worthy enough to put them up against the company Taurus, which is the Coolify air conditioning neck fan. So yes, I didn't feel any of them were actually reputable to go against any of the Taurus line. Now, of course, that was until now. This is a new arrival called the Ice 3 by a company called Ranvu. This is their version of a neck fan air conditioning with AI technology. That's right, guys, we've got AI built in. And you know what? This neck fan is definitely worthy. In fact, there is so many features to go over in today's review on just this fan that we're not gonna cover the Coolify today. If you're interested in that video, I will definitely post it at the end of this video. Check it out, I highly recommend it. That is a very good neck fan, definitely worth checking out. But today, we're gonna show you everything that comes in this very unique box. Reason I say unique, check this out. Guys, I noticed right off the bat that when you turn it to the side, it's on angles. Yeah, the lid actually is on an angle. Sorry, but I just had to show you the attention to detail on their creativity of a box lid. Yeah, a box lid. That's right, I'm boasting about a box lid on this channel. What you gonna do about it? Attack me down in the comments. Also coming in the box is a thank you for making our common dreams come true card. Very nice indeed with a QR code on the back. You're also gonna get a safety guideline brochure, which yeah, safety here, safety there. I mean, yeah, you don't wanna blow yourself up. Don't uh, stick it in the tub while it's plugged in. You know better than that. You'll also get the quick guide pamphlet. And lastly, you get this very nice brochure showing you about us from when they started 2020 all the way up to 2023 of this year, full of beautiful colored pictures that explains all about what this system can do and how wonderful it is. This calls for attention to detail. Also coming in the box is a USB type A to a USB type C 
which the type A actually comes apart into a type C. So they give you both options. I told you Ranvu is definitely all about the attention to detail. They also kicked in this nice silvery bag with their logo on the front and it has these really nice draw cords to pull it tight. It's a very nice touch but when I see bags like this I think of like my wife's coach bags that come with those dust proof bags is to keep the dust off the neck fan as far as protecting it from dropping it in this no bueno. They also kicked in this stand actually. I thought it was a charging dock at first, but it is absolutely not. It is 100% a stand for your fan. The unique part about it is it has a sensor on the top. What that does for you is activate the fan and you can put it on a desk and make it into a desk fan instead of wearing it on your neck. Quite unique. And lastly, you get the Ranvu Ice 3 air conditioning AI fan that right off the bat, when I picked this up, I thought, okay, it's got a little bit of weight to it compared to the Taurus, of course, but for good reason. And I'm gonna show you all of that in today's review. Here, you'll see the Ice 3 Ranvu logo on the left side. On the right side, you see the word performance. And let me tell you, that word definitely is an understatement because this, folks, performs. At the top is your power on and off switch. Then at the bottom left is your mode switch. That's right, you get three different modes. By pressing and holding, you get a solid blue, which is the air conditioning. Press it again, you get solid red, which is heat. That's right, it's not only an air conditioner, it's a heater as well. So you're gonna be able to use this all year round. Bonus, press and hold again, and you get white, which is the AI mode artificial intelligence for those that didn't know. Speaking of AI, just under the unit where it rests on your neck is the AI sensor. This is where it measures your heart rate, your steps, calories, all the stuff you have in your health app, like on your Apple phone or your Android phone, it's going to log on this. That's crazy. Next, you have two semiconductor plates along with the seven air ducts that blow cold air. Then you get more cooling vents here and here. Going back to the top, just under the power button, you have your USB Type-C charging port. And guess what, guys? For all those questions that I used to get on the Taurus, can I plug this in while I wear it? Absolutely not when it came to Taurus. But when it comes to Ranvu, you, my friends, are in luck. That's right, grab yourself any power bank, plug it in, and you'll have cool run-ins all day long. Now, you see the vents just under that? Yeah, they're not vents. They're speakers. Yes, that's right, you can play your music and answer phone calls on this neck fan oh as well via a Bluetooth connection to any mobile device that you're using. Also, unlike Taurus has. Let's take a closer look at the touch screen found on the left side of the ICE 3. This is where you're gonna be able to swipe through the menus, like swiping down brings up the temperature control and your fan speed. Swiping right will cycle through your AI menus, your temperature, and your play pause forward and reverse a track, and even volume up and down functions. Again, unlike Taurus. All right, let's nerd out with me and cover what really sets us apart from all the other neck fans out there on the market today. They're calling this the ultimate summer cooling device. With their exclusive Ice Max technology, Ice 3 packs enough cooling to withstand temperatures reaching over 105 degrees Fahrenheit, 40.56 Celsius for my overseas friends. The ICE-3 achieves cooling within one second using its four IMAX cooling engines. It truly is an air conditioner on the go. They say it will give you the true whole body cooling experience using their three different cooling methods in materials, system, and duct design. The ICE-3 will cool down to a minus 39 degrees Fahrenheit, 22 Celsius, after passing through two pelletiers and covers the whole body with those seven upward and downward air ducts. Hence, making you feel like you're in an air-conditioned room everywhere you go. 
Now, of course, this is their words, not mine. With their innovative AI technology, ICE-3 features six vital signs and ambient temperatures and will adjust to that particular environment, like outside jogging or hiking, or even going back inside into an air conditioning room or building. Those six sensors will provide amazing response speeds in the slightest changing of any temperatures. That's impressive. Let's talk about the battery life. With the Ranvu's Ice 3's 7,000 milliamp battery, you'll get 12 hours on the fan mode, six hours in cooling mode, and 6.5 hours with heat mode. This thing has got everything but the kitchen sink. Now, of course, you could wear this at the kitchen sink. Also worth mentioning, it has a fast charging two and a half hours to fill it completely. And lastly, it comes with a fully controlled app called Metura, also unlike Taurus. What do you say we cover those app features next? Keep in mind, you won't be able to do anything in the app until you actually turn the system on. Press and hold the power button until you hear this. We're connected. Right now you won't hear the fan until I actually put it around my neck. That is because I have the wear detection enabled. I'm gonna show you exactly where you can find that in the app in just a second. But first, let's cover the size. On the neck, circumference is 12 to 17 inches, 30 to 44 centimeters. And on the neck diameter is 3.5 to 5.7 inches, 9 to 14.5 centimeters. All right, let's go ahead and put this on. And like I said, as soon as it goes around my neck, you'll probably hear it. Come on. There it is. Can you hear that fan? Because there's also a switch in the app to silence it. And right now I can feel the two cold plates on my neck. It feels so refreshing. All right, let's go ahead and assume that you guys are all apped up and ready to rock. Click on the Metura app. There it will search for your Ice 3 and bring up the home screen. Now you should see an animated Ice 3 air conditioner along with your battery percent and the current temperature. Alongside that is your sidebar that you can slide up or down to adjust the temperature. Also have your wind speed settings as well. So let's go ahead and try that now. We've got it down to 28. Let's kick it up and I'm gonna be quiet so you can hear it. This is all, the, oh, let's go up to 100%. Woo. That just kicked it up. Um, I'm sure you guys can hear that, but uh, you know what? Let me uh, take off the hat. It'll be a lot easier to see this neck fan. Sorry about the yeah, missing hair, but uh, oh man, does that feel good. I'm gonna go ahead and drop the temperature down to, uh, let's go 70 degrees. Right away, I feel the two plates just chilling. I mean, it feels like you just pulled it out of the freezer. I'm not kidding. Wow, does that feel good. And especially in the studio, guys, because the lighting in here and the PC in the background creates so much heat in my room. And I know a lot of you, when I've done neck fans in the past, you've asked, well, you're in an air conditioning room testing it out. How does it really work out in the real hot degrees, right? It works absolutely perfect because I've taken this to my shop, which is supposed to have air, not really. And it worked flawlessly. All the guys wanted to steal it from me, but I wasn't having it. Let's go ahead and click on the AI, which is auto mode. This thing is amazing. It's crazy. It's changed the temperature and it's changed the fan speed. And it's going to try to cool my body into feeling much more comfortable than what it is now. Now we can also adjust the presets of the AI by clicking this arrow up. The first thing you see is silent mode. Remember I talked about that? Wow, that is so cool. So the ambient has dropped it, but I can still feel the fan. Oh, that's incredible. Wow. All right, turn that back off. And here comes the fan again. Then we have hot pack. Now I'd really hate to try this right now in this hot studio, but I'm going to for you guys because that's how I roll on the channel. Click on that and now it is going to change the pads. Oh wow, instantly. That is crazy. It went from cold to hot like that. Okay, well forget that, we don't need hot. It does feel good though, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. All right, let's go cooling first. Click on that. Fans kick on. 
plates are starting to get cold again. That's crazy. And then they have battery life first. So yeah, they've thought of everything. You click on that and now it is going to reserve your battery usage. Which, I mean, if you have a power bank connected to this thing, you're not gonna need this. You also have sanitary, stress relief, and muscle relief. This thing is going to work according to your heart rate, according to your stress levels of your blood oxygen. It's going to read all that with that AI sensor. And lastly, we have heating mode. Oh man. All right, so yeah, you can definitely adjust the Fahrenheit and you can also adjust the speed as well. But I'm telling you, if you have some neck pain, that heating element is gonna come in super handy. Also, I'm a hunter and I mean, to be in a blind or a tree stand wearing this with that heat, you could sit out there for hours. And hours and hours. All right, let me show you a few more tricks in the bag. Click on the three dots, goes into settings. So we click on the wearing detection. And right now, when I take this off, you hear it turn off, okay? When I put it back on, kicks back on. So that really will save your battery. You have music call. Now you have to keep this on if you're going to play music. Just remember that or take phone calls, okay? Keep that engaged and I'll show you that in just a second. Under that is screen display. You can adjust the brightness up or down and then you can also adjust the screen timed out. Just under that you have the unit. That's right guys, this is where you will be able to pick Fahrenheit or Celsius. So you can do a voice reminder uh, toggle on and off. You have vibration standard on or vibration off. That's if you don't wanna feel the neck fan tingle you. Then you have this very intuitive instructions, which will show you how it operates. But of course, Brandon's here to do that for you today. But hey, if you tend to forget, you can always resort back to this. Oh, and a quick tip, by the way, when it says here in the instructions, press the screen to enter quick control. No, you don't press the screen. Believe me, I tried many times and I just couldn't get it to work. I thought I had a defective unit, right? You swipe down to bring it up. You're welcome. Then you'll get your language choice. And lastly, and most important, keep the firmware up to date. That way you guys will have all the bells and whistles working at 100%. All right, let's go ahead and throw you a music test so you can hear how this sounds. I picked a song from a royalty-free platform called Audio that I use. Definitely don't wanna get flagged in this test. So the song is called Portrait by Wes Harris. Now, of course, I've done a lot of reviews of earbuds and Bluetooth speakers and headphones and things like that. You are not going to get that kind of quality coming out of these little speakers, but you will, however, be able to enjoy maybe your favorite song while you're cooling down or eating up. This life is sort of like a portrait. And you just gotta cherish the moment before you notice. Time moves quick at the same. Uh, I mean, it's definitely loud enough. If you're just kicking back, sitting outside, maybe listening to a podcast or something, and you want to cool down, this is the ticket. All right, let's go ahead and cover my pros and cons. Next. As far as pros and cons go, guys, we are definitely putting this up against the Taurus. Coolify 2 is the last one they sent me. There is a Coolify 3 out there, but this is their special edition and the prices are very comparable. Pro number one is obviously the feature rich system that this provides us. If you guys are in the market for a brand new neck fan, never had one before, this is definitely the one to shoot for with all the features. Now, of course, the Taurus has air conditioning and heat, okay, and the fan. But I'm finding that the ICE 3 has definitely outlasted the Taurus by a huge margin. You'll definitely get that perfect chill you're looking for with their AI features and all their modes. Not to mention you can connect a phone to this, be able to check out your blood oxygen, your steps, heart rate. You have yourself a little portable doctor around your neck. By far best features that you guys are gonna love is the power bank accessibility to be able to run this. It's over 100 degrees, you got this around your neck and you don't have to worry about hitting this thing full blast because you have that power bank connected. Super important and I only can hope that Taurus catches wind 
no pun intended. And lastly, you're able to play your favorite song on this or podcasts or audiobooks. Anything you want to listen to and stay cool or hot, there you go. Where there's pros, I can always find maybe a con here or there. And the first con, or actually a suggestion, may be these come in two different colors, okay? You can get them in white or this charcoal gray black uh, material. I pick black because I want to test it at work. I want to be able to use this at work and I'm in a shop. So fingerprints on a white, Mm -mm. If you're outside with this, you might want to go with the white color because I'm not too sure about this dark color picking up the sun and making it hotter than it needs to be. So there's always that. Another con to mention is most likely to be able to operate this, you might be better off with a phone because the controls are off to the side. So when you're wearing this, you really can't see where your fingers are to control it unless you could turn off the wear detect and be able to take it off your neck, adjust it, put it back on, things like that, so. And finally, the last con, not to mention when you're comparing the Taurus to this fan, it's pricey. Both of them are, okay? And that is something we can cover right now. Wow, we're well over 20 minutes already? I told you this thing has a crap ton of features. First things first, I am not sponsored or endorsed through Ranvu. okay? They merely reached out and must have caught me on a good day because, like I said, I don't usually take on any other neck fan manufacturers, and this time I am extremely happy that I did. I'll be dropping you the affiliate Amazon link. Yes, I get a kickback. It's not huge, of course, but it helps me and the channel grow in making these wonderful videos that you guys so desire. List price, $399.99, but there is a minus 21% before checkout, making these Ice 3s $314.00 and 10 cents. Yes, it's expensive, but for the features you get, it's really a no-brainer. Now, of course, you can go and pick up the Taurus Coolify 2, which this is the latest one they've sent me. You can pick these up for $199.99, but keep in mind, you don't get the app, you don't get the AI, you do not get the phone connectivity, and you definitely don't get the power bank option. You guys ready for a fortune cookie? Let's get you out of here. All right, what will it be today? Special word of the fortune is they. Oh, that definitely triggers the pronouns. Many new friends will soon be attracted to your friendly and charming ways. Well, isn't that special? That's a nice... Now, of course, if you guys have lasted this long in the review, it is one of my longer ones. There might be something wrong with you, but hey, we don't judge here at the table. You guys know better than that. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe on your way out that door if you are not already. Make sure to see me in my next video.